Wednesday's lesson is entitled God's election. God calls us, God selects and elects us for something very interesting. There are two aspects of this election. Romans chapter 8 verse 28 tells us, And we know that all things work together for good to those who love God, to those who are called according to His purpose. God calls us for a purpose. And uh, verse 29 tells, For whom He foreknew, He also predestined to be confirmed to the image of His Son, that He, may be, he might be the firstborn among many brethren. It's talking about a, a, a theological word uh, uh, called predestination. What did God call us for? What did God predestine us? According to Romans chapter 8 verse 29, we all have been predestined for salvation. To be saved. That's why God gave our Lord Jesus Christ. What does John 3.16 say? For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. For whom? That whosoever Jesus, salvation is there through Jesus Christ for everyone. We are called, we are chosen, we are predestined for salvation. To be adopted into the family of God. It doesn't matter what your background has been. If you and I accept Jesus Christ, we are all chosen for salvation. But there is a second aspect of uh, this calling or this election. It is found in Romans chapter 9. In Romans chapter 9, we find that God has called us for a very specific task. First of all, God calls us all for salvation, but God calls individuals for a specific task. For example, God chose Jacob. Jacob to be a father of the Israelites, the nation. God chose them to be his representatives to the world, that through them, the whole world might come to know the true God. God, in this lesson, God chose Ezra for a specific task of rebuilding Jerusalem spiritually. God chose Jerubabel to lead uh, the first batch of captives to Jerusalem. God chose Nehemiah to uh, rebuild the walls of Jerusalem. God called people for a specific task, even today. God is calling, God has called all of us to be saved into His kingdom. God has called all of us. But there is also a specific task that God is calling you and me to do. In these last days, God has chosen you and me to be His representatives, to keep His commandments, to reflect His love that others may come, come to know God through our lives. May you and I be faithful to Him uh, in the specific call that He has called us to. God bless you.